Don't be afraid. Good morning. It's the first and we're having a shitty one. We woke up to the truck not, what is it, starting? Yeah. And my t car tire's flat. So well, it says it's, it's low. low. It's low. We just got, so she has to go fix everything. So I gotta go deal with the tires, which I should have already done dead, but I put it off, so that's just kind of like a, okay, time to get to it. But the battery in the truck, we barely got this thing. So that's really just our shitty morning so far. And yeah. I and Billy woke us up at the crack of dawn, so we both have been up since like 4 a.m. Did you see this guy? I didn't. No, I thought he was gonna stop and let uh -uh. me go. Nope, he's I just casually walking, like no big deal. You wanna park towards the front? Uh babe, yeah, once I can get over there. Okay guys, we gotta go deal with this. Uh blah. Okay guys, so we got the battery replaced. Luckily it was under warranty and it didn't cost any money. Then we needed to get some other things for the car and the truck that we've just been waiting to get, like windshield wiper fluid and um, a windshield wiper blade for the car. So now I'm heading to Discount Tire to get the rest of the tires for the car and hopefully that doesn't take too long. <laughs> okay, update, we're out getting breakfast burritos. No. And I'm getting a Rex burrito. She's getting a lunch burrito. I'm getting a lunch burrito. It's a little before 11. The car's dropped off at the tire place because it's going to take like two hours. I bet it, I wouldn't doubt it if it takes three hours before they get to that car. But um, that's going to be taken care of. How about Giada, you guys? My beautiful fiance came to pick me up and rescue me from the old people nightmare that was discount tire. Everybody's having tire problems today. Right? It was the most packed I've ever seen it. And uh, I have only green sauce. Do you want green sauce? You only have green sauce? Oh no. No faith in me. Babe's making them make red sauce for her. Yeah. Gotta get that red sauce. No green sauce. I don't like green sauce either. I just would have went salsa. I love I love the red sauce. It's so good. Ugh. Ugh. I'm so happy. Thank you so Thank much. Thank you. You too. Yeah. I'm not eating. I asked stuff. for three and look, babe made them make five. No, I eat three by myself Gosh. and then you want to take them. No. You guys, it's not very much sauce in that. I need literally all of those just for my burrito and I only eat half. Leaning tower of salsa. She was trying to only give me red sauce and she was like, oh, I haven't been able to make them. No, you better go over there and make me my red sauce. You are known for your red sauce. To be sauce. fair, there's nobody behind us, so I don't see why she couldn't do and it. And your green sauce. And there's nobody ordering at the front counter. You're, she's fine. She needs to take her little lazy booty cheeks over there and go get my sauce together. Filbertos, come on. Get your you got to have the red sauce. You got to. That's part of the taste. Like, the burrito just don't taste right without that stuff. I was like, it really I, I was literally was like, well, refund my burrito because I don't want it now. I'll eat it. No. I probably still will eat it. Okay, guys, we're going to go home, relax, and then not have to do shit until the car's ready, hopefully. And babe got the AC to work. The AC was broken after we replaced the battery because, of course, everything's going wrong today. So I don't half know why, because the... October 1st is like, seriously, like, I, you know what it is? I haven't posted my Jason, hello, October, with the nipple picture yet. So you pretty much gave us bad luck. I'm sorry, babe, my bad. I knew the battery was going to be messed up, but one half of the truck was blowing hot air, the other half of the truck's blowing cold air, and I was real fucking heated because I was like, I just, I was about to take it down to these people and be like, look, I'm going to After drive this, we replaced the battery, it started doing I'm that. I'm going to drive this motherfucker through the window. You better get your life right and fix my AC now because now it's broken. But while I was driving to the tire place, babe figured it out. I looked it up. She's amazing and is a fixer of all things. Sometimes. Except for dryers. I just was shot with the dryer. I did not want to fix that dryer. I had fixed that washer like four times. I was not about to fix that dryer. That's when I stepped in. Yeah, because I was like, buy a new set. <laughs> and I was like, we broke. <laughs> <laughs> and I didn't know washers and dryers were like a thousand dollars. Well, nice ones, yeah. The fancy ones. I'll buy a new washer and dryer set when we move into the nice house. Oh, yeah. Not for this place. We'll just throw these ones up for 25 bucks each. Shit, I saw that broke ass one for $35. What are you talking about? That thing was broke. Right, the handle $45. Fell off. Come on. $50 they each. They work. They work. They just don't look the best. 
Man, people can't drive in Arizona when it's like the least bit cloudy. They're like, there's a droplet of water outside? Oh my God. They really can't drive. It's so stupid. The ground's not Ooh, wet. I don't know what this lady's doing. That was fucking crazy. She's texting. Ugh. Texters. Okay, we're home and I really want my burrito, so bye. Okay, guys, so I fell asleep. <laughs> and uh, babe fell asleep. We took a nap. And I came down to get the car. Um, got all the new tires on it. And I didn't want to spend the money, but it needed it. So now we're all officially set to go up north this weekend. And um, yeah, I didn't want to spend all this couple hundred bucks on tires. You know what I mean? But it is what it is. That's what happened. I didn't want to do it before, so I got warranty on all of them, so I should be set. That um, definitely helps when you got the warranty, so I should be covered for a while. Um, car needs an oil change, so I'll probably try to get that done when um, we come back from the trip, or maybe tomorrow. Um, but, yeah, so the kids are coming off, or coming off, the kids are getting off of school in the next 30 minutes here, and I think we are just gonna hang out and maybe do something small for dinner, how the kids make dinner, really small like dinner, and then uh, we gotta go to our self-defense class, which I'm gonna try to get some footage of, but I don't know if they're gonna let me film a lot, so we'll see, but yeah, I just wanted to update you. Uh, got the battery done, got the tires done on the car, which definitely was needed, and yeah, that's where we're at. What a crazy, crappy day. All right, see ya. Hey guys, we're here at our uh, self-defense class, all of us. Chloe, get in the shot. Say hi. This is you, the reason why we're here is because of Chloe, and we're going to specifically be learning Krav Maga, so uh, I'll try to do what I can in there. I don't know what I'll be able to do. Hey guys, I am editing this and I'm realizing I forgot to end the vlog. It was kind of dark after the class and we didn't want to film in the car on the way home, but we did really enjoy ourselves and it was really informative and it really was eye-opening to um, someone who's never attended a self-defense class how serious a situation can be and how like useful those skills would be if you were ever god forbid in that situation and i think it was really beneficial um it would be great to keep attending them but the place we went to the price point was a little out of our budget we might uh check out a few other places and see if um they coincide with those types of principles that we really enjoyed from this class along with um, a better price point not saying like there's anything wrong with that I know they're just like really hardcore experts at the place we went to and um, it if we don't find a place where they seem as um, knowledgeable then we'll probably go back and see how we can fit it into our budget because I think it's really important for Chloe to learn those skills before she heads off to college and um, it was really cool just to see like how some basic skills can get you out of a sticky situation. So um, it was interesting and it felt like um, a little workout of, it, of its own. So um, that was our night. And I just wanted to say if you made it this far, thank you so much for watching. Make sure you stay tuned. Videos every single day, all month long. We have a trip up north later this week. Follow with a whole bunch of other fun stuff we're doing including the state fair and possibly some haunted houses so stay tuned